Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q3 of the weekly contest 303 Design a Food Rating System. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about my food rating system. Um, this one is just a lot of, it's similar to the Q3 that we had in the bi weekly, actually, if you did that contest, which is that it's just a lot of keeping track and then a lot of just um, putting things in the right way and stuff like that, what I call bookkeeping, because you're basically making sure that when you modify things in one place, you modify in all the places. And as long as everything is consistent, then you can use one of the data structures to um, do the tr things that you need to do. And here I used sorted list because the sorted list allows me to, um, allows me to get the, the best item or the, the biggest item. And here, you have to be a little bit careful with the lexicographically smaller name as well. So yeah, but the way that I did it is just this code, which is a lot of, like I said, bookkeeping. You basically keep track of the rating and you here just to look up for the food and the cuisine. And then here's the meat of the thing, which is that for each cuisine, we keep a, a sorted list, which is what it sounds like, right? But you go in other languages, you can also use some kind of like a, a set or something like this, some kind of data structure that lets you or heap to get the biggest element um, and then also modify it, right? And here, you know, these are just setting the things, like I said, set the cuisine and the rating of a given food. And here is the meat where we put it in and by default, we can sort it by a tuple. And here we want to sort by the biggest rating and as the, and as the tiebreaker, the food name as the lexicographically smaller one. So that's why we have it this way. Um, for the highest weighted, it's pretty straightforward because we want the, the the biggest number to be, biggest weighting to be in the front with the lexicographically smaller as the tiebreaker. So that's what this is for. We, we get the cuisine. For each cuisine, we get the first element. And then for the first element, we get the food name, which is, you know, here. And change weighting is kind of the meat of the problem, though it's still not that bad. It is basically, uh, yeah, um, yeah, basically it is just keeping track, right? Here we have the previous rating, maybe for consistency, I should have done this. Um, but yeah, you get the previous rating and then you set the thing to the new rating, right? Um, and then here, that means then all the places we, where we, touch the rating, which is only here, really. Um, we have to update it. So we remove the old one and then we put in the new one. Um, and that's pretty much it. Uh, this change rating will take log n time and this will also be log n time because this has two add removals and this one has one, uh, uh, just return one fetch. So yeah, so everything is going to be log n. So that's going to be fast enough for me to not worry about it. So yeah, um, that's pretty much all I have for this one. Let me know what you think. And you could watch me solve it live during the contest now. Also, just to say, this is n log n, because for n items, there's n we add removal. So yeah. Anyway, you can watch me solve it live now. Okay, is it too slow? That's my only worry. Okay. A food rating system. Okay, rating over food. This seems like another sort of this problem, maybe. How do you get the rating? I was in this long thing, okay. Uh, <clears throat> modify the rating, okay. Okay. Um, what's it called, lookup? Highest rated for what? How do I? Oh, the f is the first word. How do you? I don't know. Do the food that's our cuisine. What is the list of? Oh, okay. This is the cuisine. Okay. Okay. So I don't think I read that correctly, but. Why is it in 2D away? But okay, fine. Um,
No, oh, we should have picked something easy to clean up. But okay, so then now. Down here, um, so we want the cuisine, which is uh, the cuisine of food. Dot add the rating and then self dot run in food. Okay, change rating. So here, we'll just return to Oh, um, well, this is the rating, so then also one. Okay, change rating as previous is equal to some food. So that by should have named it shorter. So we want to remove previous rating food. New rating, we'll add that in and then also update. Okay. <sighs> One time hour, that's good, I suppose. Why is it not a uh, what's wait? What is this given in? Oh, hmm. I totally misread this, but okay, fine. Uh, let's see. Totally misread how they did the input, but food ratings doesn't have. Of that rating, no, you're not wrong. She's not on the list. Hmm. Oh, oops. Wow, so many typos. So many typos, I'm getting way limited. Kimchi, ramen, sushi. Oh, geez. They make it really hard to. Kimchi, ramen, sushi, ramen. Oh, the last one is. Hmm, so I got that one wrong. Okay. I mean, better now than later, I guess. Okay. Oh, the, the tiebreakers or something, right? Uh, okay. That means that, okay, I forgot about the alphabet order. That's good because, well, it's better that we're doing it now than later. Kimchi ramen, sushi ramen. Kimchi ramen, sushi ramen. Yeah, it looks okay. Come on. Okay, good. Oh, wait a minute. Wow, people already finished. <coughs> yeah, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this poem. Uh, and yeah, stay good, stay healthy, take a mental health. Take care and I'll see you later. Bye bye.